Hey guys, it's Aislinn and in today's video, I'm going to be trying out some Brad Mondo products. He sent over four different products for me to try. So I'm gonna go ahead and film it for you guys because I have gotten a few comments asking if I could try his brand. So we're gonna go ahead and try the products he sent. I'm also gonna show you guys how I curl my hair. I get so many questions about this. I already have a video showing you guys how I curl my hair, but a couple things have changed since I filmed that last video. So I'm just gonna update you guys on how I curl my hair and we're gonna try out these products and see if I like them or not. All right, let's go ahead and open up the package and see what's inside. This package has been here for like a month and I've been dying to open it. Let's see what kind of goodies we're gonna use today. So inside the package, it says great hair starts here and he signed it for me. So here's the packaging, so cute, I'm obsessed. Okay, so we have four products in here. We have electric rain moisture cream. We have prismatic glow hydrating mask and we have force field heat shield heat protecting spray. And the last product looks like it's some type of oil. So let's see, Viper Smoothing Oil. Oh, I love oils, I'm obsessed with them. Let's read a little bit about these products. Let's start with the hydrating mask. This says, refract and attack that dry hair. This hydrating mask formulated with the richest ingredients including argan oil and Baobab oil, I don't know how to say that word, to leave your hair nourished and hydrated AF. After using Project X Everyday Shampoo, apply product to damp hair and leave on for five minutes or longer if you're free. Use once a week or whenever your hair needs some epic moisture. Okay, awesome. So it's just a deep conditioning mask you can use in the shower. I'm gonna go ahead and smell it. Oh yeah, this <laughs> smells good. It's a, like a perfect blend of feminine and masculine scent. <gasps> Stop. Is this, oh, it's holographic. The mask is like duochrome. I don't know if you can, you guys will be able to see it. I just rubbed some on the back of my hand and it has like a purpley duochrome hint to it. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and do the mask. Leave this on for five minutes and I'll be back. I'm back. <laughs> okay, so first of all, this product is so rich and thick and the smell is so amazing my hair feels so good this mask is so perfect for hydrating your hair especially going to summertime when you get frizz and your hair gets more dry from the sun and the environment all right let's move on to the next product electric rain so this says today's forecast calls for electric rain this formula includes argan oil and rice proteins to hydrate and rebuild your hair electric rain will leave you with a smooth amplified look and a high voltage shine distribute a generous amount of product starting at the ends of your hair and working your way up finish style and strike a pose. I wonder if all the products are gonna smell the same or if they're gonna have different fragrances. Okay, this smells just like the deep conditioning mask. Love that. So I'm just gonna squirt some in my hand. Ooh, look how thick this is. I bet this makes your hair feel really great. So we're gonna start at the ends of our hair. I feel like this kind of feels like a leave-in conditioning treatment also. Oh, it is, it's moisturing cream. Okay, so this is a leave-in conditioner. Brad already knows my hair needs all of this stuff. The only suggestion I have with the leave-in um, conditioning cream, the electric rain, is if you feel like you can't get any volume to your hair, go easy on the product because it is a leave-in conditioner. So it's going to weigh your hair down a little bit if you use too much. So if you have trouble with getting movement and body to your hair, just use a small amount of the electric rain. It's making my hair feel so soft wow okay i knew the products would be good but like i am overly excited with how good these are Ooh, beach my hair feels so soft after the mask and leave-in treatment all right so next we're gonna go ahead and do the oil i love oil i use it every single day in my hair and i drench it in my hair while it's wet and then i put more in it when it's dry brad has more products than just these four but i'm so glad he sent me these four products because these are exactly what my hair needs. My hair is bleached, it's damaged, it's dry. So these products are literally perfect for my hair. We're gonna go ahead and use the Viper Smoothing Oil. Let me read you what this says. Slither and smooth out your hair with an injection of Viper Smoothing Oil. This product infuses carrot seed oil and bibab oil. It's the same oil that was in the deep conditioning mask. To leave your hair slippery, smooth, and ready to take on your prey. 
Starting with a couple of pumps, work throughout your ends, continue through your mids. Apply more if your hair is craving extra hydration and shine. Okay. Ooh. <laughs> Sorry, I got excited. It's hella thick. I love thick hair oils. Ooh. Ooh, beach. I'm so excited. Okay, wait. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> I wish I could explain smells to you guys. I love that they all smell the same, so that way your hair isn't competing with different fragrances. Your hair is gonna have one nice uniform smell to it, and it's gonna make that smell even stronger. The last product is the Ex Mondo Force Field Heat Shield, so let me read you what this says. Always use protection. This formula uses the latest in heat protection technology to shield your hair from heat styling damage, protect detangle, and reduce drying time with force field heat shield. Spray 12 inches away to evenly coat damp hair, comb or brush through, and style as usual. I love heat protectants that have this spray nozzle. If you don't know, the current heat protectant I use has similar packaging with the spray nozzle, and also it comes with a lock. If you're traveling and you're worried about this leaking or spraying out, then you can just hit the lock button so that way it won't spray when you're traveling oh it smells so good wow i'm so excited and happy like i'm so glad these products aren't crap <laughs> and i don't have to say anything bad like he made this video real easy because everything is amazing and i love everything i've tried so i don't have to say anything bad this is a little sticky on my hand right now you can see it's kind of sticky on my hand which tells me it's probably gonna add some texture to your hair when you're styling, so that way it's not so weighed down. So let's go ahead and blow dry my hair and then we'll style it. Okay, I'm back. My hair is dried. It gave my hair a lot of body and volume. I'm gonna go ahead and add one or two more pumps of the oil. This is just normally what I do. And I'm gonna focus this more on the ends of my hair and then I work my way up. And then with whatever's left over, I normally just go like this to smooth down any little flyaways. And also the oil makes your hair so shiny. I'm pretty sure this is an inch and a half or an inch and a quarter. I can't remember what iron this is. Also, mine probably looks different. It's a Marcel. Most hairstylists use this, so it's just like what I'm used to and what I know. So I just start by sectioning my hair and I take the first section about at my temples and then I take a huge clip Clip all the rest out of the way, split it down the middle and bring the two sides forward. And I already sprayed the Ex Mondo all over in my hair, but normally I would use my heat protectant on dry hair. So I just curl like the mid shaft area and leave the ends hanging out because I personally like it when it's more like a beachy wave versus like a very tight coiled curl. So just like that. How you curl your hair is gonna depend on like what kind of curl you want. If you want them a little bit tighter, then go all the way to the bottom and use a smaller curling iron. I like mine again to be more like a beachy wave. My hair feels so soft. Also, some people like to curl all away from their face. Some people like to curl towards and away from their face and mix it up. Normally when you're doing like a beachy wave, you do both so that way there's more texture in the hair. It really annoys me whenever I have curls going towards my face because then it obviously will fall more into your face and I can't stand having hair like in my face. So like right here, I'm curling away from my face. You can see I'm going that way. So there's those two sides. I just leave the curls sit until I'm completely done. And then drop down my hair and the next section is right here. I normally only do three sections in my hair when I curl. I like to take thicker sections because I like mine to be more loose. If you want your curls to be a little bit tighter, then take smaller sections. I'm gonna continue to use these products. They're gonna be my new hair care routine. I'm gonna look and see what other products he has too because I wouldn't mind having the shampoo, conditioner, and I know he has a product called Glitterati. And I always like to brush through the sections before I curl it so that way it's more of an even curl. So as you can see, my hair is a lot longer than it was. So I like to curl the top and then I just slide the curling iron down and then rewrap.
Once I have the curls done, I just let them cool down because if you rake them out while they're hot, then you'll lose some of the curl. So you can see it's not a tight curl. It's just kind of a loose wave. I like doing this better because you still maintain the length of your hair. If you do tighter curls, obviously your hair is going to shrink up more. So I prefer this way and I like it to look more like natural and wavy. So that is how I curl my hair. Sometimes I put like a root volumizer texture spray up here just to make it a little bit more full and have a little bit more volume. And then I'll hit it with a hairspray just to have it stay in place all day. My hair smells amazing. It feels amazing. 10 out of 10. If you have thought about trying Brad Mondo's products, I would 100% recommend. I can tell that he put thought into the packaging. There's good ingredients in there. He's a hairstylist, so he knows what ingredients are good and what are bad and what's going to repair your hair and make it feel better. And you can definitely feel that through these products. I'm gonna continue using these. They're gonna be my new hair care routine because every single product I tried, I loved and the fragrance of them like makes my mouth water. <laughs> I love it so much. That is all for today's video. Don't forget to check out my Instagram. The link to that is in the description down below. I post way more of my everyday life on there. Give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. I love you guys so much. And until next time guys, stay weird. Bye. I mean